<laughs> I got to show you guys something. Um, so a fan just sent me this and um, I had no idea this existed. So in my last video, I talked about rhyming um, and I've always done it the old fashioned way, you know, with uh, good old elbow grease. So I just sit and I think about rhymes and that's all I've ever needed. But you guys are going to like this one second. Let me pull it up. OK, so check this out. Rhymezone.com. Have you ever heard of this? I, I had never heard of such a thing. So um, basically, I mean, you're probably thinking, is this what I think it is? Yes, it is. Trust me. So I've been using it and it's a blast for one thing. So um, just a quick video. I just wanted to go through this because I feel like this is probably very underutilized, kind of an obscure thing. Um, but I think it could help out, especially people who are just starting out. You're going to love this. This is great for your writing. So I just want to, let's try a classic here. So I'm going to try a word. Let's see what they got. Cat. Look at this. 343 results. That's crazy. So now, and you know, I, of course I thought cat, do they have bat was the first thing I had. I was thinking was, do they have bat? Yes, of course. Then they got some other ones that you'd never think of like, um, diff, visat, and jaddy. Well, obviously Jaddy doesn't rhyme with uh, cat, but this is new technology. They're still kind of figuring it out. So, um, and I have sent some emails to the team for words I've noticed that don't seem to rhyme or rhymes I thought of that um, words, words, I, rhymes I thought of that they don't have. Like for example, for cat, they have cocked hat, but they don't have baseball hat. So I sent them an email saying, you might want to add that if you're going to do all the hats. Um, so things like that. But watch this, because this is this is pretty wild. And if you're a poetry person, you're going to know right away when I start typing this word why this is just like, um, who knows what could happen, right? So watch this. Yeah, orange. Let's see. Look at that. I've, I mean, I did this before, so I'm, I've calmed down a little bit, but two results. <laughs> I mean, and they're like gorange and sporange. So, uh, and they have a wonderful example from Four Seconds by Bare Naked Ladies, which that's a poet I have not, I'm not familiar with, but they are doing it right. You've got turning orange, caught it in the door hinge. So how cool is that? So I, this is just a quick video. I want to make sure people knew about this and, um, I wanted to make sure that um, these people get some recognition for building this tool because this is so fun. I've just been typing in words all day. Like, watch this. Um, apple. <laughs> cool. We got Dapple. Snapple. I don't, again, see, this is not, I don't know. That's a brand. It might be a sponsorship thing. Snapple might be kicking them a few bucks to say, hey, we know it's not, a, you know, normally we don't consider proper nouns in, in our canonical list of rhyming words, but it's going to get us exposure. And so maybe they have a deal going on. It might be a sponsored thing. They should put sponsored. I, that's a little, eh, but anyways, um, let's try one more just for fun. My name, Zachary. Okay, okay. Daquery, Quackery. Zachary, 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 and Zachary. That's cool, cool stuff. So give this, give this site, I'll put this in the description. Give it a shot. And I just want to see, comment below all the words that you see that rhyme. This is just, oh man, okay, okay, Whew, I got to calm down. Uh, I'll talk to you guys later, bye.